In this video, we replace both the interior cabin filter and the biodefense system HEPA cabin filter on a 2018 Tesla Model S, which is equipped with bioweapon defense mode. This feature has been available as an option on this model since 2016 and became standard equipment after July 2018. We start with the interior cabin filter, which has a recommended service interval of every 24 months, regardless of mileage. First, remove the lower trim panel below the glove box lid, carefully unclipping it from the dashboard. Then, push the release button to open the glove box. Using a trim panel removal tool, slide it into the gap and release the side panel. Then, detach the wiring harness. Firmly grip the upper trim panel, unclip this from the dashboard, pulling it away and put it to one side. With all surrounding panels removed, remove the six retaining screws from the glove box, then slide the glove box out, keeping the wiring harness attached. This reveals the location of the cabin filter. Unclip the cover, then slide out the cabin filter, checking for any excess leaves or debris. Install the new Phoebe Activated Carbon Cabin Filter 178273 in the reverse order, ensuring it is installed with the airflow arrows facing upwards. Then refit the cover. Slide the glove box assembly back into the dashboard. Refit the six retaining screws, then refit the upper, side and lower trim panels, ensuring all the panels are correctly fitted and clipped into place. Moving on to the bioweapon defense mode HEPA cabin filter, which is located in the front of the car. The recommended service interval for this filter is every 36 months, regardless of mileage. Open the bonnet via the touchscreen control panel. Remove the contents of the tub and remove the weather seal. Unscrew the two rubber bump stops retaining the side panels, then unclip the upper panel below the windscreen and remove. Unclip and remove the left and right side panels. This is followed by unclipping and removing the front panel. With the surrounding panels removed, Take out the liner from the tub, detaching the wiring harness for the lamp and the emergency release switch. Then remove all the retaining bolts and the two plastic clips at the front of the tub. Raise the tub and pull through the wiring harness. Remove the tub completely, revealing the filter assembly. Unclip the filter frame from the cabin air intake and remove the assembly to change the filter. Phoebe offers a cost-effective, sustainable replacement solution for this HEPA filter. The Phoebe Replacement Filter 182548 replaces the filter media section only. This is unlike the OE part, where both the reusable frame and the filter are replaced as one unit. On the bench, using a sharp knife, cut around the filter, releasing the bonded media from the frame. Then pull out the old filter media. Install the new Phoebe filter into the frame, taking note of the airflow arrows. The new filter is equipped with a foam surround for a precise fit into the frame. Once assembled, reinstall the filter assembly back into the car, attaching it to the cabin air intake tube. Reinstall the tub, routing the wiring harness through the hole. Then refit all fixings, followed by the liner. Refit all surrounding panels, clipping them into place, followed by the weather seal. Then close the bonnet. With both filters replaced, this restores the bioweapon defense mode which recirculates the air through the high-quality HEPA filter. 
purifying it within the cabin whilst avoiding the intake of contaminated outside air. Keeping it clean with Phoebe filters.